Linux can be turned into anything. But this time I will try my best to turn it into Windows 11. Let's just start by quickly opening the terminal and then... Now let's open up the extensions manager, then go to browse, user teams, this one, install. And now we can proceed with the first step of windows Windowsifying Linux. We need icons. I have found this Windows 11 icon team on GitHub. Git clone and the projects link. Easy. Then cd win11 icon team install sh. So far so good. Now let's open up tweaks. Go to appearance icons windows 11. And there immediately we have some windows 11 icons. I think this looks accurate enough. We even have the windows folder icons. They are very colorful. What's the next logical thing that we would need? Probably the entire team itself. I found this one. Git clone paste. We have an install sh script, so let's just run that. Then let's open up tweaks, appearance, applications, fluent light, this one we need, cursor, dmz, white, I think that looks accurate, it's just a little bit small, shell, fluent light, this one, it looks great. Okay, it doesn't. It doesn't look great right now, but we're gonna fix it. Now we have the entire shell, we have the icons of Windows 11, we just have to organize them. And actually first let's get a Windows 11 wallpaper. Let's get the most basic one. I think I downloaded it. Now let's go to downloads and there it is. Set as background. And there we have it. And also I just remembered we need fonts. So I just found this exact font online. I think we need this one, the regular one. And let's just click on install. Now it's installed and let's go to tweaks and then fonts, interface text, Sego UI, this one. I think that looks accurate enough. Then let's go to extensions manager, browse and find dash to panel extension by Charles G99 install. Then let's go to install and tweak this extension. So the first thing is this taskbar tab. Let's make it monitor center so that it's in the center. All of the icons show applications button. Let's turn that one off. Then left box monitor center date menu. This one goes down. App icon margin six pixels. App icon padding six pixels. Running indicator style dashes indicator style dashes. We can see that it changed just now. Behavior. Disable show over you on startup. Fine tune. Let's set both of these ones to 16 pixels and padding all of them to 4 pixels. And that's about all we had to do there. Then once again in extensions manager, let's go to browse and we need arc menu by Andrew Z. Install. This is what we are going to use to make a start menu for our Linux Windows clone abomination then arc menu let's customize it let's go to menu menu layout and modern menu layouts 11 then menu visual appearance override menu location bottom centered that looks about right and that's all we had to do there is a resemblance of the windows start menu and all applications are here and there's a search bar as well it kind of looks like budget windows but one more problem is that the start menu icon is not the windows icon and for that i'm gonna go and find windows 11 start menu menu i icon png I'm gonna grab this one. So let's go back to extensions manager, arc menu customize. You just go to menu button and then choose a new icon, browse. It's kind of small, so let me just... I think this should be fine. Then let's go extensions manager once again, browse and blur my shell by this guy, install. Then let's go ahead and customize it. We need to set our Sigma grind set to 10 and then brightness to 1 and override background off and then let's go browse date formatter by this guy install then let's go and customize it we need to find pattern and edit this line days year something something i think i'm gonna keep it like this the taskbar looks a bit weird dash the panel is that where i edit it panel thickness default is 48 let's set it to 64 Let's go back to arc menu and then menu button icon and let's make it bigger so that it's in line with the others. 
42 for the icon. Okay, and back to the dash to panel. I think I'm gonna leave it at 90. And then I don't like that there's a home folder. Let's go to desktop icon settings and disable show home folder. This is how our Linux Windows clone looks like. As we can see, we have the wallpaper, the desktop. God, it, it's, it's kind of scary, actually. We have all the icons from Windows. We have a start menu. All the... everything is there. Is that a macOS icon? No way. I might be wrong, but that does look like a macOS icon. But yeah, I, I think this start menu is better than the Windows start menu and the search bar because you have no ads and no copilot. If you enjoyed this video, then we have one more thing left to do. Get to the chopper.